It is my belief that every seamstress should have a little friend in the sewing room. My little friend's name is Hudson, and he is a hedgehog. But hedgehogs can be messy and difficult to take care of, so if you're not up for that, you can make your own little friend. And so I have come up with the fabulous idea of a hedgehog pin cushion, and I am sharing with you today how you can make your own. These are so fun to make, and they're really easy to make as well, and they really don't take as much time. I was able to make four or five of them in a day. So you can make as many as you want. I've made my pattern digital, so you can click the link down below to print it. And you can make a big one or a small one. The big ones are for longer pins, and these pins are quite large. And then the small ones are good for regular sized pins, like these little craft pins I have here. Print out your pattern and cut out the pieces. I started with the ears and I sewed them together and flipped them inside out. Next, I sewed just the top edge of the face pieces together and then I attached the ears to the face. Then join the top edge of the body and leave a few inches unsewn in the back so that you can stuff it later. Attach the head to the body. And then sew the stomach on. And make sure that you sew this carefully because you don't want the machine to catch the fabric underneath. If that's a little too tricky for you, you can always hand sew it. Then flip your hedgehog skin inside out. I like to give my hedgehogs a little weight, and to do this I added a few spoonfuls of rice. I used 7 to 8 spoonfuls for the large ones and 5 to 6 spoonfuls for the small hedgehogs. Massage the rice so that it sits only at the bottom and fill the rest of the pin cushion with pillow stuffing. and then just stitch up the opening. Now for the embroidery. I'm just going to show you some samples of what I did, but you can honestly decorate your pin cushions however you like. You can use pattern cottons, buttons, fabric paint, glitter, beads, just as long as you can still push the pins and needles through when you're done.
and they're finished. I really hope you enjoyed. I certainly had fun. Share this video with somebody who likes hedgehogs or sewing or both. And I hope you have a lovely day. Bye. Okay, I'm just checking to see if it's recording because I don't remember p pressing the record button. Hey. <laughs> he also likes to try and climb out of my hands like this. He's trying to hide in between my fingers. <laughs>